She is one of the world's greatest athletes, having a final early morning stretch of her legs ahead of her final race. Winks has won her last 32 races in a row. On Saturday in Sydney, she'll go for her 33rd. Her owners and trainers say after that it'll be retirement. They want her to go out on a high. She knows that she can do it. Um, she's got that extra capacity, extra speed, extra bit of energy. Seven years old, Winks has run 42 races and won 36 of them. The last time she failed to win was more than four years ago. The pride and the emotion that's, that Winks attracts, you know, I'm not oblivious to it and, you know, I feel it as well. But for me, I'm very proud to be such an integral part of what she's been able to achieve. And when I get on her back at the races, she gives me confidence. Many in Australia have fallen for the horse. There's a mural to her in Sydney's city centre and dozens of journalists came along to her final practice run on Thursday. It takes quite a celebrity to get this many people from the media out at six in the morning. Winks is that horse. She is, say those who followed racing for years, undoubtedly the best horse racing anywhere at the moment. She could be the best race horse ever. The times, you look at the times that she's done at racetracks and done track records and even now as a seven-year-old mare where horses aren't really supposed to be doing as much or nowhere near what she's doing. Winx's mother was a racehorse called Vegas Showgirl so her foal was named after a famous Las Vegas burlesque show. On Saturday Winx will be the show, the one all eyes are watching. Andrew Thomas, Al Jazeera, Sydney.